Good evening. Welcome to the BBA Middle School High School Winter Concert. I want to thank everyone for coming out tonight and supporting our fine arts program. We have a couple of quick announcements for you. If you have a phone, please place it on vibrate or silent. I know that's something I always forget, and inevitably it happens in the middle of a concert. Somebody reminds me by sending me a text, so please do that now. We'll be live streaming tonight, so if you, while you have your phone out, put it on silent and vibrate, want to send a quick text to someone and let them know, they can go to the BBA web, our BBC website and watch the live stream tonight in case you have family that's out of town and can't be here. We also have DVDs that will be made. You can purchase those as well. Our coffee shop is open tonight throughout the program. We'll be live streaming into there. So if you have a small child, since we do not have child care available, you can always go into the coffee shop and enjoy the show while letting the child be as loud as they want to be. Our PTO uh, always, always wants to have you come out and be a part of things, so take a chance to stop by, look around for our PTO representatives, and see how you can be involved. We have bathrooms right outside these doors and down the hallway, so make sure that if you need to, just exit quietly. Our photographer will be moving around tonight taking photos, so please be mindful that from time to time you may have a slight obstruction of view while a photo is being taken for our yearbook. And last but not least, we want to thank God tonight for the talents that he's given to these students. And as they give back and show us what they can do with the talents that he's given from our teachers who have instructed them. And the best way to do that is to pray, so let's pray for them. Dearly Father, Lord, we thank you for this day you have given. Father, we thank you that you have made some of us musicians. You've made some of us performers. And Lord, I thank you that you've made some of us capable of teaching them, stirring the gift that's within them. And Lord, I pray tonight that you'll be honored and glorified as they put their talents to use in the form of entertainment. And this I pray in Jesus' name. Amen.
I'm Miles Scarborough, and as all of you may know, Thursday, November 26th is Thanksgiving. It's a time where families can gather around, fellowship, and gain about five pounds from the enormous feast their grandmother made. But I wanted to read a passage from, Thanksgiving, from the Bible that shows the true purpose of Thanksgiving. Psalm 96 through 100. O oh, sing to the Lord a new song. Sing to the Lord all the earth. Sing to the Lord and bless his name. Tell of his salvation from day to day. Declare his glory among the nations, his marvelous works among the people. For great is the Lord and greatly to be praised. He is to be feared above all the gods, for all the gods of the people are worthless idols. But the Lord made the heavens. Splendor and majesty are before him. Strength and beauty are in his sanctuary. Ascribe to the Lord, O families of the people. Ascribe to the Lord glory and strength. Ascribe to the Lord the glory due his name. Bring an offering and come into his courts. Worship the Lord in the splendor of holiness. Tremble before him all the earth. Say among the nations, the Lord reigns. Yes, the, Lord, the world is established. It shall never be moved. He will judge the peoples with equity. Let the heavens be glad and let the earth rejoice. Let the sea roar and all that fills it. Let the field exult and everything in it. Then shall all the trees of the forest sing for joy before the Lord, for he comes. For he comes to judge the earth. He will judge the world in righteousness and the peoples in his faithfulness. The Lord reigns. Let the earth rejoice. Let the many coastlands be glad. Clouds and thickness are all around him. Righteousness and justice are the foundation of his throne. Fire goes before him and burns up his adversaries all around. His lightnings light up the world. The earth sees and trembles. The mountains melt like wax before the Lord, before the Lord of all the earth. The heavens proclaim his righteousness, and all the people see his glory. All worshippers of images are put to shame, who make their boast in worthless idols. Worship him, all you gods. Zion hears and is glad, and the daughters of Judah rejoice. Because of your judgments, O Lord, for you, O Lord, are the most high over all the earth. You are exalted far above all gods. O you who love the Lord hate evil. He preserves the lives of his saints. He delivers them from the hand of the wicked. Light is sown for the righteous, and joy for the upright in heart. Rejoice in the Lord, O you righteous, and give thanks to his holy name. O sing to the Lord a new song, for he has done marvelous things. His right hand and his holy arm have worked salvation for him. The Lord has made known his salvation. He has revealed his righteousness in the sight of the nations. He has remembered his steadfast love and faithfulness to the house of Israel. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation of our God. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all the earth. Break forth into joyous song and sing praises. Sing praises to the Lord with the lyre, with the lyre and the sound of melody, with trumpets and the sound of the horn. Make a joyful noise before the King, the Lord. Let the sea roar and all that fills it, the world and those who dwell it. Let the rivers clap their hands. Let the hells sing together before the Lord, for he comes to judge the earth. He will judge the world with righteousness and the peoples with equity. The Lord reigns, let the peoples tremble. He sits a throne upon the cherubim, let the earth quake. The Lord is great in Zion. He is exalted over all the peoples. Let them praise your great and awesome name. Holy is he. The king in his might loves justice. You have established equity. You have executed justice and righteousness in Jacob. Exalt the Lord our God. Worship at his footstool. Holy is he. Moses and Aaron were among his priests. Samuel also was among those who called upon his name. They called to the Lord and he answered them. In the pillar of the cloud, he spoke to them. They kept his testimonies and the statute that he gave them. Our Lord, our God, you answered them. You are forgiving God to them, but an avenger of their wrongdoings. Exalt the Lord, our God, and worship at his holy mountain. For the Lord, our God, is holy. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all ye earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come into his presence with singing. Know that the Lord, he is God. It is he who hath made us, and not we ourselves. We are his people and the sheep of his pasture. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving, and into his courts with praise. Give thanks to him, and bless his name. For the Lord is good, his steadfast love endures forever, and his faithfulness to all generations. I encourage you this thanksgiving to understand the true purpose. The purpose to glorify God with every fiber of your being. To put away the earthly desires, and focus on what is truly important. Glorifying our God in heaven. Thank you.
Just so. 
Wow. I mean, what, what do you say? Thank you for giving us an amazing night of refinement. Much of the world has no idea what this was all about tonight. It was excellent. It was amazing. It was superb. It was done exceptionally well. It's a reflection of your hard work and absolutely the leadership of uh, Brother Roth. Thank you so much, Brother. You have been an unbelievable blessing to our ministry. <laughs> Students, there will be things that you will regret doing in high school. You will remember and you'll look back and say, I wish I hadn't done that. I promise you, you will not regret participating in fine arts. That will not be a regret. You are building skills that you can use for the rest of your life to the glory of God. Let's pray. Father, we thank you so much for the enablement that you provide to young people to move their fingers and their hands in such synchronized manner. Father, I was baffled as I watched hands move with what looked like such simplicity and yet a reflection of hours and hours and hours of practice. Father, you are worthy of all praise and we thank you for giving us the gift of music, allowing us to enjoy an hour of just wonderful, wonderful music. Thank you for the students who sang tonight. Thank you for Miles, dear God, who took us to your throne and reminded us that you are the sovereign and that you are worthy of all praise. We appreciate the way he read your word of God with such passion, reflective of a love he has for you. Thank you, God, for the levels of choir and singing tonight. Thank you, Lord, for giving us this academy. Father, thank you for the gift of these parents and grandparents who sacrifice so that their students can be here. Father, we pray that you would continue to bless this academy. May you be pleased in the years to come with the efforts that's made. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for attending. You are dismissed.